Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is Brittany. So in today's video, I will be showing you guys some fall lip colors. I have gotten some from Amazon, from Walmart, from Smashbox, from different places to show you guys and I'm super excited. Cause y'all know, if you don't know, I love makeup sometimes more than I love wigs. I actually think I love makeup more than I love wigs. Okay, so I have already done a review on this wig if you guys are interested. This is Sensational's Brielle. I just have her pinned back so I can show off my my jewelry here. Okay, so if you are interested in Brielle, I do have a video on that, a review. It's on the info card. Um, so go watch that after you watch this video. So I have a lot of different fall lip colors to show you guys. Most of them are gonna be matte because I prefer matte. And if I do a gloss, it's usually gonna be a clear gloss, but I do have like one brown gloss that I'm gonna show you guys as well. So I'm excited about that. So if you are new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. Please consider subscribing before you leave. I do a little bit of everything over here. I do a lot of hair and wig content, makeup, home decor, fashion, some vlogs, and just whatever else I'm inspired to put on here, I put it on this channel. So if that sounds like something you would be interested in, please subscribe. And shout out to my returning subscribers for watching, especially my premiere squad. Thank you so much for coming back. Before we get into these looks, this portion of the video is sponsored by Anna Luisa. I have heard about them several times from other people here on YouTube and Instagram. They are a sustainable jewelry company. So they have a lot of simple, elegant, unique pieces that are good for the planet. So they have high quality yet affordable pieces. Some of their pieces start at like $39 and they go up from there. A lot of nice, simple, elegant stuff. So I'm gonna, you know, put some footage in of some of the pieces that they sent me and I'm wearing all of them today. And if you follow me on Instagram, I've asked you guys on my stories, like what's your experience been like with getting the upper part of your ear pierced? And some of you guys say it doesn't heal. It takes forever to heal, like sometimes like a couple of years. And I was like, I don't want to do that. So I definitely wanted to try their ear cuffs and I'll have a better, you know, some better footage that's close up here. These are so cute. So I have like a smaller hoop one here and then this larger one in gold. They're both in gold. Then I have these simple elegant earrings here. And over here, I have another large ear cuff here, but it's in silver, but it doesn't clash with the whole look. I think it's cool to mix metals and different finishes together. They are carbon neutral, so they care about how their products affect the planet, so that's very good. So, you know, if you guys are interested in any of these pieces, you can head over to Ana Luisa. I'll have a direct link in the description box for you guys, and I do have a code. I'm living for my ears right now because this is what I want like a stacked ear with a lot of stuff on it but I'll probably just get like several um like ear cuffs and do that because that looks so cute it looks so cute it's a look so shout out to Anna Luisa for sponsoring today's video remember that coupon code that I have for you guys it'll be down in the description box so let's get into all of these fall lip colors for you guys because I'm excited I've tried on a few but yeah, not a lot of them, so. Okay, first up we have Amazonian, and this is by Maybelline. This is their Superstay Matte Ink um, Liquid Lipstick, and this is in 70 Amazonian, so. Ooh. That's pretty. Smells good, too, like vanilla. Amazonian, Maybelline. Doesn't feel dry on the lips, because I've tried some that are dry on the lips. This doesn't feel dry. This feels really good, actually. So I'm just going in with my makeup wipe and removing these. Um, I could add a lip liner with that one as well, but for the most part, I'm just gonna try these with without a lip liner. Ooh, this is pretty. This is the Maybelline Superstay Matte Ink in Globetrotter, 135 Glo Globetrotter. Oh, I think I like this one more because it's darker. So you definitely don't need a lip liner with this one. No, this is the Milani 450 Desire. 450 Desire, this is a lipstick. Ooh, it's a pretty color. Okay, let's see. I might pair this with a lip liner.
And of course, this feels good on the lips. This is not like super matte or drying. Milani Cashmere. I feel like I've tried this already. It's like a nice deep berry kind of color. Ooh. Oh, now this is giving grunge. I like that. This is the kind of stuff I wore in like 2016. Okay, a little bit patchy down here, so I have to do another coat. Also, if you're, you know, one of my, if you're one of my wig girls, I'm loving how Brielle looks pinned back and my ears exposed. It makes me like this wig more. Okay, let's blend Miss Ma'am out. Okay, y'all, this is Cashmere from Milani. This is gorgeous. Oh, this whole look is it. Ooh. This is beautiful. <sighs> oh my gosh. Ooh, this is pretty. Mmm. I haven't worn like super dark lips in a while. This is giving. I hope I got a black. I do have a black. I'll, I'll show y'all that like probably in another part, but. Okay, just to switch it up, we're gonna do a gloss. So Revlon. Super Luscious, the gloss, um, and Choco Crush. So it's a gloss, a brown gloss. So let's see. Okay. That's cute. All right, I had to put like three coats on it and not blend my lips together. But here is Revlon Choco Crush. This is cool, but I really, I'm, I'm probably gonna wear it, but I do prefer my darker colors to be matte. But this is cute and it's like on trend, but give me a matte or a semi-matte when it comes to darker colors. But I still wanted to show you guys. All right, let's move on to some NYX lingerie. They're matte liquid lipsticks. Okay, so the first one I'm gonna show you guys is the NYX Lingerie XXL. This is their matte liquid lipstick in Hot Caramello. Hot Caramello. Oh, this just looks like my lips. I like the color of my lips already. I feel like I need a lip liner with this because it's so close to what my lips are. So here is Hot Caramello. Hot Caramello with no lip liner. I think it's screaming for a lip liner, so I'm gonna use the Lip Bar Straight Living. That's better. I'm gonna put a little bit more on. There we go, that's better. Okay, next up we have the NYX Lingerie XXL Matte Liquid Lipstick in Candela Bay. Candela Bay. Ooh, this is kind of more of a coral color, so this might not be like, I guess, not that fall. I'm gonna just pair it with a lip liner because I cannot just wear this like by itself. I don't think I want to. Let me put Straight Living with this one too. It will change like the look of it, but I gotta, you know, tone it down if it don't look right. Oh, it's better, but I'm not like crazy about that one. Okay, so these next two inspired this video. So, um, Minted has some liquid lipsticks and I've actually been wearing these, this combo a lot. Hot Chocolate, which is a brown, and Blood Orange, which is like a blood orange, like a rust color, and y'all know I love rust. So I'm gonna try on Minted Hot Date. I usually use this as my lip liner for Blood Orange, but I'm gonna try them separately on their own. Feels very creamy. This is nice by itself. I, I, I don't think I've tried it by itself. I've just been wearing it as lip liner, but it looks good. Okay, so next up we have Blood Orange from Minted. Let's go ahead and try it. And this is a fresh one, because I've had one of these for like over a year, and it was kind of drying out. 
Such a gorgeous color. Oh my gosh. Love me like a a rust moment. That my lips look like velvet. That's pretty cool. Let me fix this up, child. Blood orange. This is very drying. This feels very dry on the lips. Um, like 2016 kind of dry on the lips, but um I still like it because I wear this one all the time, but it's very drying, so keep that in mind. Okay, next up we have the Lip Bar Savage. I've had this one for a while, actually. Nice brown. This is more of a red brown than the Hot Date from Minted. I like how this applicator is kind of like angled, pointy, so it's easily it's easy to get around like your cube as well. This is cute. I'm telling y'all, I love the vibe of my ears and this hair. The whole look, really, the whole look. Okay, so I'm doing 15 in total. I was just doing like what I had, but then I was like 15 is a better number than like 14. So I'm doing 15 of these in total. It's not that, not that bad. So I am gonna do, this is Juvia's Place. This is their lipstick in Coco. Nice brown right here. Nice brown. I haven't used it because this looks fresh. Okay. This is a regular lipstick here. Nice and vampy. Feels very soft on the lips, like not too drying. Oh my gosh, I love dark lips. This is all I was doing back in the day. And back in the day, it's 26. That's cute, and I've never worn this. And I've had this for a while, I think. The vampy dark, super vampy dark ones are just like my favorite. I love them. It's so crazy. I love me a nude moment, but the super dark looks, I like them too. Okay, here's another gloss. This is the NYX Butter Gloss in Ginger Snap. So it's a dark brown. Um, I'm not gonna wear it by itself. I'm gonna wear some lip liner with this. This is Straight Living by The Lip Bar. I think I like Ginger Snap more than I like the Revlon Crush. Yeah, this is nice. Okay, next up we have the Smashbox liquid lipstick in a rusty orange color, which is what I was looking for when I was shopping. Like this is like the truest pumpkin out of all of the rusty kind of orange colors that I tried. This is more orange orange. But not like too orange to where I wouldn't wear it. I like this orange. I'm kind of like, I'm not gonna wear it with a lip liner, but I do kind of like a ombre situation with my lips that are like this. But it's really cute. I think it's cute. Um, it still, it feels pretty drying, but not as dry as the minted one. Okay, next we have Smashbox Liquid Lipstick in Misconduct. This one is Misconduct. Another eggplant situation. Okay, last one we have is Smashbox Tar Pit, which is black, okay? Ooh, oh yeah, uh-huh. This is beautiful, especially for this time of year as far as like, you know, Halloween, but if you like that grungy look all year round, this is nice. Cause some, I got another um, black lipstick, liquid lipstick, and it's a little bit too like sheer. This is nice. All right, 
right guys, so those were all 15 of the fall lip colors that I wanted to show you guys that I have in my collection. I actually have more, but I think 15 is enough. Okay, so um, I put back on my favorite, which is Milani Cashmere lips. It's not like too drying. Uh, yeah. Any of the lip products that I featured in this video, I'll have them linked down below. Most of them will be um, affiliate links. So if you shop through those links, you do support my channel and I really appreciate that. If you like the pieces that I was wearing in this video from Ana Luisa, I have those linked down in the description box as well. Shout out to Ana Luisa for sponsoring um, this video. And be sure to use my coupon code, theheartsandcake10 at checkout so you can save 10% off of your purchase. If you have not subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Follow me on all of my social media platforms, TikTok and Instagram at iFancyCupcakes, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.